Yosuke-kun. All right. Hey, Yukiko, I want to ask you something. Is this some kind of surprise party? You guys didn't tell me anything about... What's that stench? Huh? I thought there was a wet dog here. Sorry. Um, so, Yukiko-san, did you run into Teddy or Rise? They're calling this a Grand Prix and making us fight to see who the winner is. Apparently we can't leave until... You're talking too much. I have about as much interest in what you're saying as I do in Plankton. Plankton? But you can't even see those without a microscope. Yukiko, this isn't a welcome back surprise for you, is it? Hmm? No, it's a Grand Prix for you, Yosuke-kun. And given what a goddamn pain in the ass it's been so far, I can't wait till it's over. Dude, what's with the language? Have even you gone nuts? What the hell, man? Oh, so that's why hers was carnivore. But the Grand Prix for me? What's that supposed to mean? Hmm. Now you're ignoring me? Ugh. Even if this is all an act, it's still soul crushing. Hey, listen, we can't leave here until the Grand Prix ends. So let's just half ass this. If you don't mind going on to the next round, I'll forfeit without attacking you. Oh, though if we did it that way, you'd have to fight again. Hey, Yukiko, will you lose this round for me? Even though you've lost in the battle of life? Yikes, this snow black is really bad for my fragile ego. Why is my fan so large? Why, my dear? The better to shut up that filthy mouth of yours. That's the wrong fairy tale. Ah, oh, fine. I'll end this as quick as I can, so bear with me for a bit. Wow, things are starting to heat up! Let's get this battle started! Damn it, looks like I really have to overcome the Amagi challenge if I want to get out of here. Yukiko, are you all right? Oh, thank goodness. You've gone back to your usual self, Yosuke-kun. What? Oh, are you back to normal too? Huh? But you just seem so eager to fight no matter how I tried to stop you. You said things like, I was taking the easy way out. I was sure that you just weren't in your right mind. You noticed that Tere and Rise-chan are acting strange too, right? I think maybe they're under the enemy's control. Control? Who could make them act that weird? No ordinary person could pull that off. Then why would they do it to start a stupid tournament like this? In any case, I'm gonna go put an end to this Grand Prix. If it's just us four, there's only one more battle to go. And one more thing, there is a student council president. Oh, do you mean the girl with the ponytail? You met her? Mm-hmm. When I talked to her, she said she was going to the announcement room. I tried to stop her, but an invisible wall blocked my path. That girl's in danger. Really? Sorry, I gotta go. 
I'll end this as fast as I can and come back for you. Oh, okay. Be careful. And try to help out that girl. I'm sure you can do it, Yosuke-kun. Got it. 